this is Ed. Welcome to another Exchange 2016 video. Uh, in today's video, I want to talk about the Q Viewer. Now, in Exchange um, 2010, if you launched the Exchange Management uh, Console, you would have like an option at the bottom here where you could click Tools and then go to Q Viewer. You still have the option to do that, in, but in Exchange 2016, it actually sits underneath the folder called uh, Microsoft Exchange Server 2016, and then there's your toolbox. Now, in your toolbox, um, there's not much you can actually do uh, compared to 2010, where you could do remote check and message tracking and stuff like that. Now, once this launches, um, you'll see we only have two options. So while we wait for that, 2016 gives you the option to, you know, you can also do a, a get Q minus server ex2016a. And you'll notice that I have um, obviously nothing happening because my server doesn't know how to send outside, etc. But there's a good way to check. Now you'll notice that I didn't type get transport server because Exchange 2016 is combined with the so all the roles are put into one, everything else is a service. So, your mailbox role, and then you get your transport service. Um, if I wanted to just do a get dash q, you'll see I'm only seeing this. But if I go and see get transport service, sorry. Um, Get Q. Just thinking a little bit. And there you can now see, I can see my second server because I say get transport service, get Q. Okay, so get Q, if you're on a server that's got the hubs or etc. on it, it'll work. If you want to check it for multiple servers, they changed the um, command from get transport server. It still works. So if you notice get trans transport server and you do the same thing, you'll notice it's, it gives you a nice warning to say that it's going to be removed in future versions. Okay. Now coming back to the toolbox, I can do the same thing and check. If I just wait for it to open, You'll see I'm connected to this server and I can see the same queue that I saw here is there. Sorry. I can connect to um, my other server and do refresh and you can see I've got a submission queue and there I've got a submission queue. And that's pretty much how you can check your queues in Exchange 2016. Thank you for watching.